Okay, it's September 21st, 2014. Late yesterday I got this long-awaited box from Lion Country Supply and this morning we're going to open it up. It should have the Sport Dog Tech 2 uh, e-collar in there, so I'm pretty excited. Uh, what I have been running on my dogs are uh, Sport Dog, I believe it's a 1225 model. It's done really well. I've added a uh, beeper collar, which I like, but everyone I've talked to and things that I've read about this new Tech 2 is that there's features on there that are going to allow me to do away with this beeper collar. So I'm excited about that. So let's see what's in the box. Notice the uh, Lion Country Supply Knife. Should uh, work well. I guess we're going to open it from the end. Okay, and another box to open. This one might be a little more of a challenge. Sport Dog's done a good job of sealing these. Here we have the transmitter and screen. I guess the antenna attaches on top here. Basic training kit and it looks like a DVD. Have to watch that later. have a collar. Looks like it's a standard one inch collar. Same as what I have been running so I could looks like I could switch it out should I want to. I know these come with large antennas but that's I believe a function of the the GPS which the receiver I believe is is in here not sure I like it it's not that much bigger than the 1225 and the quick start guide that will be helpful. Let's see what else is in here. Ah, oh, this I wasn't expecting. Looks like a nice gear bag. Pretty heavy duty. Has wire reinforcements up around the zipper so it stays open. Oh, that'll be nice. Let's see. Looks like a USB charger. And a 
a second USB charger both the same I believe one is for the collar and one is for the transmitter that would be my guess and these must be for the charging unit I'm guessing here's the charging unit plugs into a standard wall outlet then looks like a transmitter port and a collar port A nice lanyard for the transmitter. Looks like a pair of spare contacts for the collar. They should come in handy. They look to be the same as the ones that are on the collar. Well, no. They are look to be a little bit longer so maybe for some thick haired dogs good idea uh, this is labeled a light tester I guess to put the contacts on there I usually just stick it on my arm and shock myself but if my dog can take it I can take it this I'm going to have to figure out. Have uh, no idea what it is, but we'll figure it out. There is a USB port in it. Some contacts on the face. Don't know yet. Okay, that's it. Uh, the new sport dog. Tech 2, an Allen wrench also. I like the feel of this. I think I'm going to like this, this uh, selector wheel. I have a Garmin Colorado unit with one of these. Button in the center, rocker buttons, up, down, left, right. Uh, I like it on my Garmin uh, Colorado GPS. I know this does not have a touch screen and if it's cold and I've got gloves on, a touch screen isn't going to do me any good. Two selector buttons here, three on the side. Uh, the only thing I haven't found yet is the antenna. And I guess that's... There it is. <laughs> It was laying in the bottom of this. Got all camouflage black. So now, so there we have it. The new Sport Dog Tech 2. I can't wait to get out and see what it's all about.